Hi, this is a review of uh, the Real Housewives of uh, Potomac. Uh, basically, it started with Katie. Um, she had a, a dinner, I mean, a lunch with a friend of hers, and she was talking about Karen Party and how that it was um, so much of a flop. And then um, it didn't have the um, decor of a, you know, a real, of a gala event. But um, Karen had said that her husband wanted a small event and not a really something big because he was still dealing with the death of his uh, mother. So that's why the um, event wasn't, you know, as elaborate as Karen, no, as um, Katie might have thought that, you know, it should have been. And then um, Robin and uh, Andrew um, talked and uh, he's not um, moving to another state for his coaching job, but he found somewhere local in the... Um, the DMV um, area. So, you know, she's pretty happy about that. So she's excited or whatever. Um, I don't know what's going to happen with that relationship. And um, next week is the finale. So I wonder, are they going to, uh, is he going to propose or do whatever? Uh, what else happened? Um, Karen was uh, uh, planning a barbecue for her daughter and then her husband uh, forgot to get the balloons and they had called her and told her that, um, you know, the balloons were ready. And then she uh, asked um, Ray, you know, what was going on with that. And he would say he just got, you know, busy and he just forgot. And basically, Karen started freaking out because, um, you know, she, you know, I guess that's basically what she does in her life. And she pretty much want um, everything to um, go uh, perfect. So she was a little upset about the balloons. And then she had to go to her room and close her door and stuff like that. And what else happened? Um, oh, and then Sharice was uh, playing her 50th anniversary. And um, Katie came by and uh, helped her to um, take some photos. And she basically said that the event um, cost her um, between fifty dollars and $80,000. I thought that was pretty nice. And, you know, I think she did have it at a, um, a museum. So I guess, you know, the rental fee for the museum was uh, very expensive. The event looked very nice. The, um the music was cool, and um, sh uh, she also um, did a little rap, so I thought that was interesting. It was cute, you know, but um, we're not looking for an album coming from her, but everything was pretty good. What else happened? Oh, oh, Ashley, yeah, Ashley tried to um, talk with um, Karen, and Karen wasn't having and saying that, you know, she wasn't going to you know, talk about it right now, because she's there for Sharice and her uh, birthday party, and she wanted to you know, so much, you know, have a, um, a good time. So she really wasn't paying Ashley no mind. I think Ashley should have waited another time to actually discuss, you know, the problem that she had. Um, the, Ashley and Karen had the problem together, whatever. But again, like I said, this is going to be the finale. So maybe, you know, they'll make up in the, the next episode. You know, we just have to wait. But Cherie's party was a very success and everybody had a good time. Uh, Ashley's husband touched Andrews on the butt, and that was a big deal. So it was like booty gate, you know, touching somebody on, and you know, they made a big uh, issue out of it and stuff like that. And Ashley and, and Michael had said it wasn't a big deal. And then uh, Ashley also stated that they also does that in football and basketball. So um, tell me what you think at the bottom of the um, comment um, box, and tell me what you think. Uh, what else happened? So, um, then there was an issue or something um, Katie has said to um, Robin and um, and Grizel that and Grizel, Grizel and you know that you know they were biracial and they was like no we're not bi biracial and then um, Katie has said that you know there's no way you coming out of Africa looking the way you do with the blonde hair and her eye color and stuff like that so that basically went on and on so. You know, it's just typical, you know, chatter, you know, to keep the episode, to keep the episode um, pushing. So, and what I'm trying to think what happened at the end. But, um, so, uh, Cherie's, um, party was a success and everybody had a good time. And, um, and, uh, I think, um. Griselle had left early and she said she was tired and stuff like that. And 
she was kind of like over um, Katie with you know the statement that she had made about the uh, race or whatever stuff like that. So that's uh, basically what happened. Um, please um, subscribe, leave a comment, and um, like the video. And basically, see you later. Thanks.